Meanwhile, Mark Taylor has testified before the FDA, which recently issued warnings on the side effects of antidepressants. I'm going to speak on behalf of the thousands of innocent Americans that have died as a result of these drugs. I want to ask the FDA, are you really making noble choices? Or are you just allowing the drug companies to squeeze by you just because they have big pocketbooks? Speaker uh, 21, please come forward. My name is Mark Taylor, and I'm one of the victims, one of the many victims, of the SSRI antidepressant era. I took six to 13 bullets in the heart area at, the, at Columbine High School when Eric Harris, who was in fact on Luvox, fired at me. They almost had to amputate my leg and my arm. My heart was missed by only one millimeter. I had three surgeries. Five years later, I am still recuperating. I had to go through all of this to realize that antidepressants are dangerous for those who take them and for all those who associate with those who take them. I hope that my testimony today shows you that you need to take action immediately before more innocent people like me and you do not get hurt or die horrible deaths as a result. As Americans, we should have the right to feel safe. And if you were doing your jobs, we would be safe. Why are, are we worrying about terrorists in other countries when pharmaceutical companies have proven to be the, our biggest terrorists by releasing these drugs on an unsuspecting public? How are we supposed to be, feel safe at school, at home, on the street, at church, or elsewhere if we cannot trust the FDA to do what we are paying you to do? Where were you when I got shot? You say that these antidepressants are effective, so why did they not help Eric Harris? According to Eric, they helped him feel suicidal. He reported to his psychiatrist, he was having psychotic reactions to the drug. They took him off it, he said he was doing great. They put him back on it, he was having suicidal thoughts again. These drugs help increase the rage in people and cause them to do things they would not do else anyways. So why do these so-called antidepressants not make him better? <clears throat> I will tell you why. It's because they don't work. We should consider antidepressants to be accomplices to the murder. This is a shame and it ought to be stopped today, not next week. The FDA decided to put warning labels on drugs nationwide, saying that drugs may cause suicidal tendencies. That's a pretty big deal. There is other news tonight. The FDA is putting out a public advisory in effect a warning that adults taking antidepressants need to be aware of possible suicide risks.